Welcome to ReCraft Fundamentals. In this video, we'll show you how to work with external models such as popular Nano Banana, GPT, Flux, and others directly inside ReCraft. External models are especially useful when you want to work with attachments quickly without switching to another tool. So let's begin. Start with an empty project in Canvas. Click on image in the left panel. Then click on the paperclip icon next to the palette. And there you go. Here you can choose any of the available models by clicking at it. If you'd like to see the full list of models, there are 16 at the moment and the list keeps growing. Open other models and styles, all models, external. Let's select the well-known Nano Banana model and walk through a few examples together. We'll begin with a simple edit, changing a girl's hair color and adding earrings. First, drag the image of the girl, generated earlier in ReCraft, onto the canvas. Then, click on the paperclip icon in the left panel and select the Nano Banana model. Type the prompt, change her hair to pink and turn her earrings into bananas. In just a few seconds, you'll see the result. This way, you can experiment as much as you like, change any detail, add new elements, work with the background, and more. But let's also take a look at some other scenarios. Now let's explore texture editing and show you how to transform this object into the other version. Here's an icon we generated earlier. It's already on the canvas. Let's say we want to see this object in a fluffy pink texture. Step one, generate the texture. Click image, keep recraft v3, and write your texture prompt. From the results, choose one you like and save it. Step two, apply the texture to the icon. Go back to the icon image, click to select it. Open the paperclip menu and choose the nano banana model. Attach the newly generated texture. Now type the prompt. Keep the main object the same, but transfer the texture from the second image onto it without changing its shape, buttons, or details. And that's it, the texture is replaced. Feel free to try it with any object or any texture you want. Finally, let's look at a more advanced case, working with photorealistic generations and style transfer. Imagine we have two images of men. The first is a simple photo. The second shows a man in a studio with professional lighting and a model-like pose. Our task is to place the man from the first image into the style of the second. Here's how to do it. Select the first image, choose the Nano Banana model, attach the second image as a style reference, and type the prompt, transfer the man's face from the first image onto the second image, while matching the style, lighting, and pose of the second image. The result will be a realistic transformation, keeping the person recognizable but in a new studio setting. Today, we explored how to find external models in ReCraft, and how to use Nano Banana for editing, texture replacement, and photorealistic style transfer. Let us know in the comments what you'd like to learn next, and don't forget to subscribe if you found this video helpful.